I managed to get XBMC compiled and running and working on my Raspberry Pi so I thought I'd show you what it's like well there's the Raspberry Pi I'm just going to plug in power and you can see it boot There we go, it's taken maybe 30 seconds or so. I've got some pictures and some videos and uh, it's accessing all of them over the network. It's not using any local storage. So let's try a couple of pictures. This is straight off Samba, shared off a, a Windows box. A little bit sluggish. No, I've actually managed to crash it. Oh well, but bother showing you those pictures. It doesn't take very long to reboot. Oh, it's booting. Check out my my mini keyboard. Nice little tiny keyboard and mouse. This is my old screen. Okay, it's booted. Let's hope it works a bit better with some music. Again, it's coming straight off the network. Hopefully you can hear that. Okay. Bit quieter. Seems it sounds quieter from the video. So it's standard definition. Five point digital. 
If it had subtitles, you could choose them. Huh. Oh no, it didn't crash. Um, yeah, I've had it crash about three times on me so far. Uh, although I've watched a few videos without any problem. Let's try another one. any um, full HD tryout. Take him out to the main road, send him on his way. That is my wife. That is my son. I went to school with Maggie, for God's sake! Shit, no! It's my call, man. I think you can keep them safe. If I stop moving, now the bottom bit disappears, I think. Yeah, there we go. It's pretty good, pretty watchable. It's, it's you know, high quality. I'm gonna try this one. This was made on the iPhone. And yeah, this is 1080. Let's see if it manages it. Mm. Nah, it's lagging over the network. I mean, I don't know if it would work best just off local storage. Come on, let's go. See if it lags again. <laughs> Actually, that's pretty impressive. 1080p straight off the network with a video made with my iPhone. Awesome. For a 20 quid bit of hardware, that is awesome. Absolutely awesome. And this is only alpha. Check out the, uh, the information here. the setting is. Uh, just to mentify that with the one. So it's picked up the IP, it's running it um, on this screen anyway, 1680 1050. Um, Build information. See the CPU at the bottom. It's 
got SSH server on it. Um, I'm just going to try try SSH again and uh, play a movie and see see if we can check out top. Uh, interesting thing though, see free many free memory H4. Well, um, the setup I've got uses half 128 meg for the video, 128 meg for the, the system. So it's it's running quite uh, quite efficiently. So I'll just SSH in. So it's one two one. So let's let's play a video. Tight P and Yeah, it looks it's pretty busy, but it's still coping on screen. Come on, it's cat. Thought I'd try uh, one of the add-ons. I was hoping for Netflix, but. Uh, yeah, that's that's a bit unrealistic. I can quite easily add some more. But I've already installed one. It only took um, a few seconds to install, really. And let's check it out. Anything interesting in there? Let's go for dancing anime. This is streaming live off the internet. Pretty good. The interesting thing is, I'm not taking much CPU. Check that out. It's hard to trace the history of the cat girl back completely. But some 